Okay, so I'm doing a um, how to care video for your rabbit. Okay, so um, yeah. So here's my rabbit. If you didn't know, he's um, um, a trio. So male Angora rabbit. His name is Sugar. If you didn't know, so yeah, he's in his little box and he has two little boxes. So, yeah. So there's a water bottle over there and also a bowl underneath it, but you can't see it because it's, he's blocking it. So he's sleeping in there. Aren't you just the sweetest boy? So, yeah. So the first thing you'll be needing is food. So this is the food I use. Is um, a, oops, I'll wait for a while. So it's pellets. So yeah, I'll give him uh, one scoop a day. So this is how it looks like. So it's rabbit food and 600 grams. So it's $2.15. So it's kind of cheap for me, I guess. So yeah. It's, it didn't come in this bottle, if you were thinking. It came from, I just used the Holix bottle. I tear out the paper and just stick this thing here. So yeah. We'll be needing hay. So I use Western Timothy hay because. Um, I heard it's very good, so I just use it. I put it in that box, so it's much easier for me to take it. So this is what you need. Uh, hay is the you need unlimited hay. Um, you can take alpha hay if you are you have rabbits six months and younger. But after six months and older, you can you should choose Timothy hay or orchard grass hay, which is that good also. So yeah. Um, I give him three scoops of this, three scoops a day. So maybe I'll do one scoop morning, afternoon, and night. So that's how I feed him. You don't have to feed your rabbit this way, but this is how I choose it. But if you're busy, you can just feed the whole thing in the morning or the whole thing at night. So yeah, he's sleeping. So yeah. So the next thing I've been needing is grooming supplies. So this is my grooming supplies. So. Um, before that, before I when I got him, Sugar had long, long, long fur. It was really long fur, but not that long, but quite long. So I cut it using this scissors. Yeah, my hand got tired after a long time. So, and over here is a nail clipper. Over here, I guess should be a flea comb. It doesn't bend, so it's really hard. So it's quite wide, I guess. Yes. And here is what um she bought. He bought bite this thing, bite not bought. So he bite it off. So yeah. So this is all the grooming supplies I have for him. Um, this works really well. I I tried it on him, but so the thing I do is just click click and press so that's how I um, I watched a YouTube video and um, on how cast rabbit pet rabbit so you say click click and yeah that really works for me because at the uh, bottom of the leg um, when I click and at the second time he moved his leg so yeah it's really good so yeah you should watch you should um, go to you can either adopt from SPCA or House Rabbit Society. So I adopted mine from SPCA. Yeah. So, um, so what you also will be needing is cleaning supplies for the cage. So, yeah. So these are the two things I have. This is is really useful. I could just sweep up the poo, and yeah. I also have tissue papers, but I don't have it right now. So. Yeah, just this has vinegar and water mixture, so that's left a bit only. And then I'll just spray it on the blood where sugar peed and use it, the tissue paper and wipe it off after a few minutes, like maybe five minutes. Yeah, so um, I do it in the flooring the cage. Um, now as you can see, the flooring is um, a green leaf. But since I don't have the fleece dry yet, because I just washed the fleece this morning. So now it's about um, maybe 12 o'clock. It's about 12 o'clock now. Um, so he, it's been drying. So now it should be almost dry, but not yet. 
Sylvia. Yeah. So here he is, so he's really cute. Um, what you also be needing is, um, what did I say just now? Um, I forgot the what did I say just now. <laughs> so, um, yeah. You will need is a litter box. Um, that is his litter box, and also over there he got two because he poops in both places. So, yeah, get two litter boxes, don't you, boy? So of course you need a food, a uh, water dish. You doesn't, you don't really need a food dish because if you have a ceramic bowl, which I don't have, then if your rabbit tips a plastic bowl over, then I don't think you would, it'll be good if you just put the food on the floor but sugar doesn't really tip over the food bowl because he's more interested in eating it but sometimes he will because yeah if he leaves it there then he will tip it over and you can either choose to use a water bottle or a water bowl which is behind him i have both of them so you can yeah a water bottle is much cleaner so yeah but when you use a water bowl it's like um more natural but he would my rabbit would tip it over because i use a plastic one so i don't have a ceramic bowl so yeah so i tried tying it there so now it's tied there so i hope he would tip it over so yeah that's the end of this video say bye sugar bye